Running and racing is brought to you by Foot Locker, America's most complete athletic footwear store. Where else are you going to go? By Exceed Sports Nutritionals. And by Nuprin, big pain relief in a little yellow pill. So what's the story here exactly? Fog in Houston in January, now fog in Philadelphia in September. Sort of the link of the show today. Fog. It's the Philadelphia distance run, no question, the best half marathon year in and year out in the country. Big reason for that, the fall marathoners looking for a big tune-up before their 26-mile effort. Great fields, fast course. Number one, Steve Jones, right in the middle, coming back to defend his title. He got ready for New York last year with a victory in Philadelphia. In the green, Diane Brewer, she just wrested the lead from a phalanx of Nike-sponsored athletes. Diane won the Parkersburg Half Marathon in August in 113 course record. Pretty gutsy flying out in front of the people chasing her right now. That's Ann Audain, closest to the camera. Olympic alternate Nan Doak Davis at 10,000 meters in front alongside Audain and Kim Jones and Margaret Gross right behind them. That's Kim in the blonde hair. 7,500 runners littered the streets of Philadelphia. It's a flat course, very fast, only one hill, and that's at eight miles as we pick up the men past the 10-mile mark. We're down to four runners. Number four on the right, Joe Insall from Kenya. He won this race back in 1983. 37 years old and huffing and puffing. Number eight, Steve Monteghetti from Australia. The new superstar marathoner from Australia, second at the London Marathon in a PR 209. Behind in the red shorts. That's Nachati El Mustafa from Morocco, getting ready for a fall marathon in the States. And defending champion Steve Jones, laboring a little bit in back. Between 10K and 10 miles, which they passed in 53-32, Nan Davis opened up the lead. 12 miles down, Zhao is history as Monteghetti and Nachati live on. Nachati's PR two hours and 10 minutes was also run at the London Marathon, as was Monteghetti's, but Nachati's was a few years back. The clock reads 57 minutes, just over one mile left in the Philadelphia distance run 1989. Oh! Shades of Joan Benoit Samuelson at the 1988 New York City Marathon, but Monteghetti goes through her, but Nachati takes advantage of that spill and opens up a gap. And don't count Zhao out, he's got a strong kick. Nachati's never won a major American road race, but either is Monteghetti. Both these guys are primarily marathoners as Monteghetti's making his move back on Nachati's shoulder. And Zhao is definitely out of it. Monteghetti to the lead. But now with one-tenth of a mile to go, Nachati returns the favor. And this time it looks like the right move at the right time. $4,000 for Nachati's victory, $2,500 for Monteghetti, $1,000 for Zal. Same dollars for the women as Nan Davis preps for her first marathon in Sacramento this December. <laughs> 